All right, guys. All right, everybody. Welcome to another video. Welcome to another episode of Making Gains. And this morning, we've got a little bit of a change of scenery. I'm in the car. I've got my coffee. 7.30 in the morning, I've got a day off work and I'm heading down to CrossFit, of course, to hit an open gym session with Achilles. Now, last night I went down to CrossFit, we did a pretty pretty hard session. The day before that was another hard session. And my my phone does not want to sit up here for me. But that's fine, we'll, we'll continue. Um, so last night was a pretty extensive warm-up, about 15-20 minutes and then we went into front squats, we did 10 sets. Oh, fuck's sake. You guys know how annoying that is? Let's try again. All right, so front squats last night. Oh no, no, no! Why are these roads so bumpy? Oh my God, here's another bump. See you later, guys. <laughs> Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Alright, we're going to go through the steering wheel, okay? So, last night we did front squats, that was the skill of the night. Uh, we had a 15 minute workout, 10 sets on the 90 second mark. So, it went 10 reps, 9 reps, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, adding weight every single time. I started at 50 kg for 10 reps, then went 55 for 9, 60 for 8, I think it was like 70 for 7, 75 for 6. 80 for 5, 85 for 4, 90 for 3, 95 for 2, 100 for 1, but I did like a 5 second pause rep for that one rep, so uh, yeah that was a 15 minute squat workout, front squats. One thing I'm working on at the moment is putting, is bringing my hands like that, like I'm going to do a clean, um, rather than crossing my, my two hands over my shoulders like that because that's just not how you do it in CrossFit. It's not how you're meant to do it. Uh, so last night, so you know, I'm practicing my, my wrist flexibility to actually get it round and get my elbows up so I can hold the bar there. But last night wasn't too bad. I was quite happy with my performance. And then following that we did the Metcon of course, which was, uh, what was it? Fuck, it was Fran actually. and. It was called Fran, and just like the workout that I talked about last time called Air Force, Fran is a standard workout that all CrossFitters will complete at some point, and just obviously try and improve your time over time. Um, so it's 21, 15, and 9 reps of 43 kilo thrusters and pull-ups. So you do 21 thrusters, 21 pull-ups, 15 thrusters, 15 pull-ups, 9 th thrusters, 9 pull-ups um, in, as, as, in as fast of a time as possible and I got 5 minutes 51 and that was my first time attempting it. Um, the best guy in the class got it in 4 minutes 30 and apparently a guy who, uh, apparently a guy who qualified for the CrossFit Games, just to put it into perspective, got that workout done in under two minutes so it's unbelievable some guys fitness is honestly like it's really humbling I'm really enjoying it with that said we're off to an open gym session right now I'm gonna meet Achilles there and um, honestly my body's pretty sore like I've done you know, I've done a few gym workouts the last few days I've done you know back yesterday chest the day before that um, arms the day before that and I've done two CrossFit classes the last two days so I've been to the gym five times in the last two days. And here we go again. So, I'm on my phone this morning. I'm not bringing the big camera down, but I will video a little bit of what we do. Um, I honestly, I'm thinking I'm gonna just go and grab a skipping rope and start skipping. I don't feel like lifting, honestly. Like, like I said, I've been to the gym a lot lately. I'm just gonna do a little bit of cardio conditioning. We're dieting at the moment, so this is gonna be considered cardio. I am fasted, I haven't eaten. So um, I'm looking forward to it, it should be good. And then after the gym session, we've got something really exciting, but I'll tell you guys about that afterwards. Peace.
right, so unfortunately, guys, um, it seems they've fucked us over at CrossFit uh, for the first time. It's actually locked when it's meant to be open. So we've decided to take some initiative, be proactive, and come across the road to Anytime Fitness. So that's where we are. Oh, so me and Achilles going to hit a session. Um, let me get it out. You want to park close enough, bro? Alright. Here we are. Alright, everybody, we're back. We're back home. And the thing, the exciting thing that I had to tell you guys about before has just happened. Uh, I just had a real estate agent come through with a prospective tenant for my property, which is exciting. And it's the perfect tenant. Um, there is a, uh, there's a company in town that works on behalf of the American slash Australian spy base, which they have in Alice Springs. And, uh, you know, people basically get relocated from wherever they're from in Australia or even in the US, and they come here and they live here for two, three, even four years. They have a contract with the base. Um, they're obviously, you know, professionals. They're not going to they're not gonna fuck up the place. Um, the rent's going to be paid on time each week. You know, it's the perfect tenant. And um, this real estate agent that I, I chose to go through, I had a meeting with all four major real estate agents in town. I wasn't just going to go with the first one. Um, so professionals is what they're called. They impressed me the most. And I've got a really good relationship with this company that works on behalf of the base. So it only took a day. She's already, um, she's already organized this, this lady to come through. Honestly, I signed the papers yesterday. And um, she's, she's already been through with this person the ideal person. Um, so fingers crossed, man, fingers crossed. Uh, we're looking at $510 per week furnished. So the other thing is, is they want it furnished and that's, that's going to suit me really well. I mean, it's really, it's nice furniture in here. I'd love to take it with me, but the fact is, is I've got nowhere to put it. And wherever I go after this, you know, wherever I go after moving out of here, I'm basically just going to be in a room. I'm not going to have, I'm not going to take on a, a whole nother lease. Um, I'm just going to rent a room as cheaply as possible and save money. And then, you know, I've got both of my properties rented um, with secure tenants. Um, and that's the position I, I always wanted to be in. So things are happening, guys. It's really exciting. So obviously that meeting was really important. They came around, they had a look at the property. Um, it's, it's all well and good, the real estate agent coming through. But it, when you've got someone who's actually going to be living here and taking on the lease, um, that's a whole different story. So I cleaned up the place. It's all, you know, it's all looking, it's all looking nice and nice and clean. So obviously that puts me in a good mood, and um, I think they liked it. I really do. So fingers crossed. Honestly, cross your fingers for me, guys, that this works out because this is the perfect tenant, and um, I'm I'm ready to move on. So with that said, uh, this morning was a bit of a change of plan. I didn't <laughs> I didn't end up going to CrossFit because. It was locked on us, so what we did, we went to Anytime Fitness, both of us have got a membership there still, me and Achilles, and we just smashed some biceps and triceps, so arms are done, and what we decided to do was go back to CrossFit tonight at 5.15, so it's a pretty, it's a pretty cool workout tonight, I'm really looking forward to it, it's called Cindy, and what it is, is 20 minutes of as many reps as possible, of these three things. So first of all, you've got five pull-ups, then you've got 10 push-ups, and then you've got 15 air squats, so body weight squats. And you just go, you know, round after round after round. So five pull-ups, 10 press-ups, 15 squats, as many times as possible in 20 minutes. And it's gonna be hard, that's all I can say. But anyways, I'm gonna take the camera down and um, I'll show you guys how we go. And that's it. Should be a good day. See you guys later. Stranded, reaching out.